Hi guys, this is Jules. Um, so week two of my tinnitus recovery. How am I doing? I'm doing good. I am healthy, I'm positive, I love life. I live in the sunshine state, so I'm very lucky to have a lot of sun, though the last two days have been very overcast. Um, but, so week two of me deciding to get better really marks week one of actually doing something. <laughs> I mean, like, I've been doing things already, which is restructuring my mindset and really going and m maintaining positivity, knowing I will get better, knowing that life is not for tinnitus. Like, tinnitus is not for life. Life is not for tinnitus. Tinnitus is just not for life, okay? And that's just a fact. Lots of people have been healed. Lots of people have gotten rid of it. Lots of people don't have it anymore. And if your ENT tells you it's forever, tell them to go wherever the sun doesn't shine. Um, wow, weird pun. But it's just not true. And I am, I'm really upset that it's making people so miserable because I felt miserable when an ENT told me that it's there's nothing else you can do right and I I'm talking to some people on Instagram and one guy's like I'm so scared like because ENT told me like I have to get a surgery I have to do this and that and like nothing's gonna get better it's just gonna get worse it's like oh my god what are you doing to this poor kid like why would you do that just to make money just to get like wealthy off of other people's demise and so don't believe it tinnitus tinnitus will get better you will get better i will get better i am getting better um so week two for me was harder because when you start the process of getting better it usually gets harder and i know that's like whatever that's stupid no but because i'm doing a lot of things to to clean my body i don't know if you see but i have like this rash on my forehead and my skin is breaking out and that's because i am detoxing my body from bad things in my life whether it's food whether it's water whatever it is and so my body is going through detox and it's obvious i've never had a rash right here but it started just because just as i began my process of detoxing myself so not a coincidence at all clearly my body has something in it and and that's actually confirmed because i went to a chinese herbalist one time and he did cupping on me and it was a lot of toxins in my body and he was like wow you have a lot of toxins and i was like from what he's like from everything but he didn't really tell me how to detox or anything like that so week two i had about four loud days out of seven but i also had three quiet days out of seven when i say quiet for me that's like a three um because if i had tinnitus at a set of three i probably would be okay but i'm not gonna like live with tinnitus i'm gonna get rid of it but threes are really healthy for me i really enjoy them i understand it makes me really understand how you are how it's inevitable for us to get better because if it consistently changes in tunes in strength in volume clearly 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 you can move your tinnitus and uh, so and even if it doesn't move you can you can you can get rid of your tinnitus whether you had noise drama whether you had it from medication whether you had it from stress whether you had it from too much caffeine um it's you're gonna get rid of it and it's gonna be okay and i'm gonna get rid of it and my these videos are not just supposed to be about hey i'm gonna get rid of it like but it's really really true so week two four loud days which i would say for me because i'm sensitive i would call them nine like a number nine i don't know if everybody would think that's a number nine some people might think it's like a seven or an eight for me it was a nine 
and then now it's like a three which might be for some people like a two or a one i don't know but for for me threes are like nice so yeah that's week two more coming up soon and I'm not really going to talk a lot about what exactly I'm doing until I am better because it doesn't make sense to do that. I've said that before. I do send out some videos about things that I believe in and that I feel very strongly about, such as the video about oxalates, such as the video about neuroplasticity. It's that's that's just educational like once you read about it you understand it's just a matter of fact and you have the choice to do something about it and I am having and I'm choosing to do something about it and anyway all right guys follow me on Instagram I call myself Jules cures her tinnitus and you can follow me there or you can just uh, look at the videos on YouTube talk to you soon